Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Glenn, and I have um, I bought a trickle charger um, from Amazon, and I just want to unbox it and to let you know what brand it is that I have purchased. Um, I have a truck, my pickup truck. It's parked. I already drive it, so um, the battery keep running down every now and then. So. I just want to have a trickle charger that I can leave on it. Okay, this one is Next Peak. Next Peak NC201. Next Peak NC201. That's what this one is. So I'm just going to open it up and look at the product. And then um, I will put it to use. And I'll show you as well how good it, it may be or how good it is. So let's open it up, guys. Okay. So nothing else is in the box. Come on, nice little sturdy box. Um, this the unit in a bubble wrap with um, a manual. Yeah, it's it's kind of big. Uh, I know they have a little. Another one, a smaller one. I forget who made that one, but it's pretty small. But this one is this one is kind of big. It's uh, probably about six six inches by three inches or something like that. So this is what it is. This is the power cord right here, and um, it has the alligator clips that would goes on to the battery. Uh, I think I'm just gonna put some power in it. Just to see lit up, just to see how it work, but um, but this one can charge vo both 12 volt and uh, 24 volts, and uh, it also have intelligent pause repair uh, charger. That means this one will help to clean your battery cells, so um, your battery that was going dead could be resurrected and um, last a, a bit more longer time than. Um, than uh the time uh, that you would have thrown it away uh so um let me just plug it in just to see what it's like it feels good doesn't seem as if it could take much dropping it, it feel like maybe it would have maybe break the case is not that really rubbery it's more a stiff plastic but we will see exactly what it's like and they have the little manual here you can um fold out and um look to see exactly what this product can do um it has seven stages of charging so you know what let's plug it in and then i'll show you exactly uh what this thing here looks like when it lit up and stuff so okay guys we plug it in and um of course the screen lit up um it also shows the temperature. It said 12 volt 20 and 24 volt smart automatic um, lead acid battery charger. So it's for lead acid battery charger. So yeah, so this is the display. Show you exactly what to do. And um, this is the mode bu button right here. This will change the modes. Um, there are so many different modes right here. It has seven different um, charging modes so uh i will take this thing on the outside and um and uh show you how it works on my um ram 3500 all right so i'll, I'll take it outside and i'll let you see you guys see exactly how it works but i it seems to be a a, a nice product based on the reviews that i see online um so I'm hoping that this will work well for me. It's a next peak NC201. Uh, so guys, it's cold and windy here in Boston. And um, I'm just gonna show you, this is my truck that been parked since um, the spring. So I'm gonna show you how this thing work. It's a 5.9 uh, diesel. You can see the terminal. Of, corroded corroded looking there 
but I'm gonna try this um, unit on it now. So this is the unit. It's the next peak. So we're gonna tell how good this thing is. So we put the live on that side here. And then we put the negative over on this side. And uh, look at the meter. Um, get it on, um, right now it's on AMG, but I'm gonna put it on um, on standard. Sorry, it's an AMG, I'm gonna put it on standard. Okay, so it's on standard. So you see, if you look at this side, you can, you can see that it's empty. There's nothing there. So it's filling from the extreme bottom. It's filling from the extreme bottom. All right. So, um, seem as if it's doing some cleaning because it's a DFS. So it's a desulfate. So it, um, I guess it's a um, cleaning battery. Did you see the corrosion on, on it earlier? I show you so it must have must have been detected all right so I'll come back and I'll let you know if this thing work I mean how quick of a time it does it works thanks so guys I'm back here now to check on this um, trickle charge unit that I place on my truck um, it's it's like six hours now but it's not fully 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 um, let's see if I can focus this Hold on, let me see something here. I just need to focus. Focus this thing here. Yeah, it, it's at 80% charge. It's not um, it's not 100% charge yet, but it's you can see it's charging. It should be able to start the truck now because it was at zero. The truck would not start earlier. So I'm gonna disconnect them and um, let me unplug the electricity first. And then I'm gonna, I'm gonna go um, try to start the truck to see if it will start it up at 80% charge. Move this out of the way. All right, guys, let's see. Should be ready to start now. Let's see if it starts. All right, wait for the lights to go out, yes. Oh, yes. It starts up. So yes, guys, it worked. This worked, guys. It is good to go. All right, so that's it. my Ram truck. It's also for sale, guy. If you want it, <laughs> just, just just check me if it's for sale. All right, so it does charge the truck up, start the truck up. So it's good. That is good. So guys, I'm back here with the unit. Um, I did test it out. I placed it on there for a few hours. Uh, it was on there since 8 a.m. to 3 p.m. Uh, it did charge one of the battery complete and then it charges the other one to 80%. So um, my truck was able to start up. So it works. I would recommend it. Um, and it worked faster because I, I had a smaller one. I forgot what the name of that one was. And it took forever. It took like two days or, or longer to, to charge the battery. But this one um, did it in a shorter time. So yes, I would recommend this battery for this unit for now. I still need to use it a few more times. I have another car parked out there that hasn't been started for about two months. Battery is totally dead. So I'm going to use it on it also to see, you know, um, how it perform. All right. Thanks for watching, guys. Please subscribe to my channel. I uh, will be bringing you more content like this one and um and other content so thanks again for watching please like share and subscribe